Yes, now. Give us some kudos. Good morning, Dad. Good morning, Mom. Good morning, oh, Eva. How are you? You're going to work? Yes, sir. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. You got this name? Oh, yes, Mom. I dropped by at home boutique yesterday to get it. It's nice, right? Oh, it's gorgeous. <laughs> Why are you spending so much on these uh, clothes? Hmm? You need to cut them. You need to oh, cut them. darling. Uh, she deserves it. She works hard for this. Mm. Honey? Mom. Won't you join us for breakfast? No, 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 Mom. I will pass. I'm actually running late for work. Okay? Oh, okay. I will join you guys for dinner. All right, darling. Yeah. Naka! Ma? Can't help me with this part. Fast. Bring it to the oh. Oh, that mom's sorry. Are you stupid? Are you blind? I'm so sorry, ma. I'm so sorry, ma. I'm so sorry. Oh. Eva, did you just hit her? That this girl is so clumsy. I've had enough. I spent the entire night arranging those files. Huh? But, but that's not enough reason for you to slap her. Dad, I'm not ready for this. I have to go. Bye, Bye darling. Enjoy your day. Did you just see that? Hi, darling. I know that she can be a little difficult sometimes, but Neka isn't right either. You heard her. She said she spent the whole night arranging those documents. But that's not enough reason to slap. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, where's where's this girl? Where's Neka? I don't understand. Do you want to swallow me? Do you want to drive the car? Get back! Sorry. Peter! Peter! Are you... Are you... Are you... Are you deaf? Are you deaf? Bring that shoe here. Bring it here. Are you stupid? Give me... Bring that shoe. Bring that shoe here. Bring that shoe here! Put it here. Uh-huh. 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 Look at him. Go. I don't know if you are confused. Come on, put this down for me. Are you, are, you, are you okay? Get off my foot. Give me my phone. Oh no, give, 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 give. Come on, you're confused. Close the door. Peter! Hurry up, idiot! Close the door. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Well, the old man is hanging in there. Oh, you, you don't know how, how much I missed you. Hmm? You don't know how much I missed you. I can't wait to see you. Yeah. Oh, that's good. That's good. You, 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 I can't wait to see you. I can't wait to see you. I can't, I'm, I, you just made me very, very happy. Everyone is fine. Everyone is fine. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, talk to you later. Eh? That's fine. Uh, uh, that was a uh, mercy. She says she'll be home. By next week, she's rounding off her program this week. Mm. Yes. <laughs> Come down. Come down. I say, calm down. Are you deaf? Get out. Ma, what? Give me the keys. Give me the keys. Pick it up. Pick it up. Give it Ma. to me. Ma, what happened? Close the door. Ma, what happened? What did I do now? What is... Which car will I have this now? Hey! You better go and look for that girl. <laughs> look for her, we are naked. You don't understand this. What should I do now? What should I do? Are you asking me? You better go and look for that girl. Because if Chief gets a whiff about this, you are dead. Hey! 
As for me, I have my own problems to deal with. So you better go and deal with your own problems. Hey! Hmm. I can't make trouble. You're asking me? So what do you want to do now? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. You're giving me less and less of your time. Because unlike you, you are your own boss. I have a father to impress. Getting named the CEO after Mr. Hamilton. I understand. But I wish you can cut the time off work and spend more time with me. You can ask your dad to give you a short vacation. Or even lie that you're sick or something. You can find your way around this thing. Let me ask you one very important question, yeah? Okay. If she was here right now, would you be this needy for me? <laughs> <laughs> I thought as much. I miss you. Get lost, Carl. Welcome, princess. Are you busy? Not really, Mom. Just tracking some products <sighs> I purchased online. All right. Your father was on call with your sister this morning. She said she's coming back next week. Hmm. That's good for her. Is it good for you? Mom, her coming back does not affect me in any way. So I don't care. You don't care. Do you think if Marcy is here right now, your father will allow you to manage his company? Huh? Mom, I have been the one handling that company before dad got you. And I've been handling it perfectly well. <laughs> Eva, Eva, don't be too confident and lose your guard. Your father can be unpredictable, you know that? Not on this mom. I trust him completely. <laughs> it's okay. You wanna see what I ordered? Mm -hmm. This is the latest Louis Vuitton, limited edition. They just released it. Wow. And I'm lucky to be among the 10 people to purchase this. Wow, beautiful. <laughs> if I listen to me, you need to cut down on your expenses. Your father has started complaining. But mom, there is money, so why is he complaining? We have so much money. You don't see it like that. You have to stop. Uh, please, I like wearing designers, Rick. It's another one. It's another color. This one. Let me see this one. <laughs> Neka. Neka, where are you coming from? I went to get something. Neka, that's a good news. What is it? I just overheard, madam. I never. They were discussing inside. Masi is coming back home. So what's the excitement all about? You know, Masi is my friend and I miss her so much. And she's a good person. Your friend? Yes, now. Just be feeling. You are jealous. Jealous of what? Well, what's there to be jealous about? I bet shift. Well, all I know is that Masi doesn't treat you well better than she treats me. So what's there? I don't know. If wishes to be horses, I'll be riding the world right now. Well, mister, if wishes were to be horses, wishes ain't horses. You are jealous, Neka. You are very jealous. You are jealous. Peter, don't go hang your coat where your hands are supposed to be. I bet she... I'm coming. Mister, if wishes were horses. <laughs> Thank you. Come back here. Where did you get this dress? Mate, it's, it's among the clothes you asked me to trash, ma. Yes, ma. And you took them? Yes, ma, I took just this one. The rest were too short, ma. <laughs> I gave you my clothes to trash. And you had the audacity to take from it? I'm, I'm sorry, ma. You're what? I'm sorry. Ma. Shut up! What is wrong with you poor people and stealing? I'm sorry. I specifically gave you some clothes 
to take them out and you had your audacity to wear it? Are you, are you normal? Are you normal? If I wanted to give you the clothes, what would I have to do to trash it in the first place? Take it off. Ma? I said take it out! And use it to mop the floor. Right now! Neka, that's enough. But dad! What's wrong with you? Dad. How can you treat your fellow human in such a manner? Dad, I asked her to trust my clothes and she stole them. She's stealing. She's a thief. That still does not give you the right to treat your fellow human being in such a degrading manner. The fact that you're in a better position today does not make you anything better than her. Now, this act must not repeat itself. You hear me? Do you get me? Yes, Dad. Good. Bye, you, bye, you, Hey, 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 hey. Coming, 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 coming. How are you? Pasi, Pasi, we are highly welcome. How are you? It's been a, long, a very long time. I know, I know, I know. How have you been? I've been fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Welcome. Hey, where's everybody? Everybody's inside. <laughs> oh, hi! Hi, <laughs> how are you? Hi, thank you, You've changed! Yes, sir, you look so beautiful. Oh, thank you. You look so beautiful as well. Like a beautiful. Ah, just a why you. Just a why you. Wait, wait, Peter. She's beautiful. <laughs> Jealous. <laughs> Uh, where is everybody? Is Daddy in? Dad is inside. Daddy. Okay, so help me get my things from the trunk, okay? I'm yeah. inside. Okay. I see you guys. Open, open, open. Neka. Neka. Sit back, sit back, sit back. Neka. This one, your one year salary can buy this one, no? This way, wait, John. Bring that thing down. Don't carry that one, though. I'm the one to carry this one. I'll carry this one. Let me handle this very carefully. Hi, Daddy! Oh, my baby! How are you? I wasn't expecting you to do anytime this week. I know, I know. I lied. I mean, I'd finished my, my program things, but I wanted to surprise you, so. Yeah, do you like my surprise? That's a big one. A big <laughs> one. Oh, I'm happy to see you, my baby. Hi, mother. Hi, Mrs. Eva. Yes, ma, I'm back. Welcome, mom. Hi, Eva. Hey. Um, take them to my room, please. The guest room, you mean? Because I'm already occupying the other room. Uh, never mind, baby. I'll get them to fix the room for you. In, in a way that fits you, okay? okay? Okay, daddy, but don't worry, don't worry, I'll handle it. Okay, you can take them to the guest room. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> ah. So, you need to rest, you need to have some rest, okay? You daddy, just did you just say rest? Journey, yeah? Hell no, you have to gist me what has been happening with you. How have you been? No, well, not me, but how was the education? How was your studies? I miss you. Understand? You understand? Oh, my baby. Neka, uh, I want to eat a fan soup. Eva! Ma. I didn't think she'd just give up her room just like that. Oh, now, wow. Eh, good thing she knows at least. <laughs> yes, babe. Yeah, I just got back. Really? What surprise? Tell me now. Tell me. Okay. Okay, I'll wait. But don't make me wait for too long. I miss you too. <laughs> yes, baby. Mm -hmm. <sighs> baby, let me call you back. Okay. Bye. Are you done? Yes, ma. Is there anything else you want me to do for you? Ma? No, no. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> oh, Neka. Before I forget, 
my butt shoes. <sighs> Watch some things. Hey, thank you. Oh, ma. Yes. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, ma. They look new and expensive. Yes. Hey. They are all for you. I bought them specifically for you. Hey, thank you so much, ma. Thank <laughs> you, ma. Thank you so much, ma. Okay. Is that a tear I see in your eyes? Stop it. Don't embarrass me. No one has ever bought anything for me. <laughs> thank you so much, ma. You know, <laughs> this is just the beginning. There's more to come. You're a part of the family now, and I don't see you any different. Mm. Hmm? Okay. Can't check if they're your size. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Um, call Peter for me while you're at it. Okay, ma. Right. Okay, thank, ma. thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. So, um, I was thinking of like changing some things in the room. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably doing like a repaint job. So, do you have an interior decor? Plug. I have so many of them. Yeah. So many of okay. them. Okay. Another thing I want to ask you. Mm. You just left your other room just like that, without a fight. Fight, you say? <laughs> you know I'm not like that. Besides, I prefer it here. I'll just change some things to make it up for my taste. <laughs> it's okay. You know what? I will just make a few calls and get back to you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank Why are you thanking me? I should be the one thanking you. You know, the cookie that I, I tested some few minutes ago. Mm. Is it testing in my mouth? <laughs> <laughs> Peter, I'm thanking you, Peter, because of your friendship. I'm thanking you for being a good friend to me. And I'm also thanking you for being there for me all those years. I haven't forgotten how you were there for me all those years when I lost my mom. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. Yeah, so rest in peace. Amen. I mean, it's been five years. Five years, and it still feels like yesterday. You know what? Not to dampen the mood, I got you something. Seriously? Hey! <laughs> I like them. I hope you like it. You want them. to lavish me with the gift. <laughs> now nah, a biscuit. Now chew. Hey. Oh. Thank you so much. <laughs> I have to start this issue. You know all this one I have been using. They are all they are food. I have to start. Oh, you don't you don't know what you did for me. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> what are you doing? You don't you won't even understand. <laughs> this Peter, you are such a clown. Well, as you both can see. I'm not getting any younger. Neither is my health getting any better. Rather, it's deteriorating. I'm glad that both of you are here so I can now retire in peace and then take good care of my health. Hmm? Now, both of you are going to be running the company together until such a time that I decide which of you it's going to take over from me. Dad, I, I, I don't understand. Like, I thought we already cleared that out. I am your first daughter, which means, which automatically means that I have to take over from you. This has nothing to do with seniority. I am interested in competence hard work, and resilience. Okay, which I've always done. I've always been doing that, right? I have been doing it perfectly well while she was away in London having the best time of her life. Point of correction, I was studying. Studying to make myself better. Well, this is not up for debate. Both of you are going to be working hard. If you want to take over the company, then prove yourself. Huh? All right. You know what, Masi? You would have actually stayed back in London 
you made a wrong decision coming back here. Because you know why? This house can't contain us. This house is too small for the both of us. Ah, Neka. Hmm? Why is Toki part of this list? I thought we just restocked. Yes, ma. I used the last one to make soup yesterday. Ha! Ah. You used a whole turkey to make a soup? No, just one kilo. It wasn't even enough. I had to top it up with beef. Wait, wait, wait. Shut your mouth. Eh? Neka, you have started stealing my food stuff to take it down your pathetic, wretched family. Eh? No, ma. God forbid. Shut your mouth. God forbid. God forbid. Now, explain to me how three full turkey Finished in two weeks. Explain. Explain. <laughs> Darling, what is it? I need to discuss something very important with you now. Eh. Oh, yeah. Get out! Look at her. How fat she is. Eating my talk and getting enlargement every day. What is it? What Mom, is it? you were right. You were right. It's dad, though. It's dad. He wants Marcy to join me in that company. He wants to know which of us is capable of handling the company. He can't be serious. He can't be serious. I'm serious. You know what your husband is capable of doing? <sighs> Don't worry. Hmm? Don't worry. I'll handle it. Eh? See, we can't debate about this. Now, it's not possible. He can't put you up for competition with that is illegitimate child. I will not let it happen. Don't worry, I'll take care of it, okay? <laughs> uh, just take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. I'll handle it, okay? Chill pill. Don't, oh, don't, don't worry, I'll handle it. Chief. What is this that I'm hearing? Huh? That you want Massey to join Eva in the company? Is that supposed to be a question? Yes, it is. Because I, I, don't, I don't see the need of Masi denying my daughter of her birthright. They are both my children. One is illegitimate and deserves nothing. Well, I've made my decision and it is final. Oh, you've made a decision and it's final? Yeah. All right, I won't let you. I won't let Masi deny my daughter of her rights. What rightly belongs to her. I won't let that daughter of your prostitute deny steal what belongs to my daughter. Oh, you want to hit me? Chief Hamilton, hit me! Hit me! You want to hit me? Because of that good for nothing girl, Mercy? Huh? Let me get one thing straight to you. Over my dead body, will I allow Mercy to become the CEO of the company we built together? Never! It won't happen! You leave my way! Rubbish. Oh, my daughter. Thank you very much. I needed this. Dad, I'm sorry. About what? I'm sorry for always causing commotion and making you guys fight. No, it has nothing to do with you. You know how your mother could be sometimes? Hmm? Dad, I don't want the company. I don't even want to be part of it. I mean, I want to build my own career. I want to start my own business. I don't want any of this. This company is as much as yours as it is for anyone else. You're my daughter. And everything that belongs to me belong to you. You have a right. You have to fight. Don't let them intimidate you. Okay? Well, Dad, I hate to see the both of you fight over me. Especially, you know, mm -hmm. issues concerning me. No. We are not fighting. Just a little misunderstanding between couples. Hmm? <sighs> now, okay, Dad. Uh, I think I need some rest. Hmm? I need to retire. 
and uh, you also need some. Hmm? Come on, Dad. Okay, have a good night. And be careful with the stairs, okay? I Take will. it easy. I will. Hmm? <laughs> good night, Dad. I don't like seeing them fight like this, especially because of me. I mean, I, I, I didn't even want to come back. I had to come back because I, I know that he needed me. I mean, what kind of daughter would abandon their father in the most difficult time? The chief is a good man, Peter. He's a good man. I mean, he was, he, he was there for me and my mom. I just don't want to disappoint him. I don't. Just, 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 just calm down. I don't want you to be, to be moody and sad. So what time you, you start crying all over again. I don't want that. If you continue like this now, you, you might, you might fall sick. And me too, I will fall sick too. <laughs> Don't be silly. I got your now, watch. <laughs> but let me tell you something. Don't allow anyone to take your happiness away from you. <sighs> Thank you, Peter. Thank you for Look at you! Whoa! I've missed you like crazy. I you too. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> oh my god, what took you so long? I mean, I've been home for three days well, now. Well, if you had informed me that you were coming back before boarding, you know, I would clear my decks to come pick you up from the airport. But I wanted to surprise you. So I'm not to blame. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> she looks so beautiful. Look at you. Thank you. You look bad yourself. <laughs> Thank you. So, tell me all about it. Your journey, your trip, everything. Yeah, it was, it was, it was so much fun, but I'm so happy to be back in Nigeria. I am so glad that you are back. <gasps> Dad, Caleb is here. Good day, Chief. Caleb. How are you doing? Very well, thank you. Please, have a seat. Yeah. Uh, Mercy, I'm getting something to drink. Um, uh, what would they give you? Uh, no, 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 no. I think I know the best. Um, Eva. Sir? Get him a glass of Hamilton wine. Me? Why not her? Because... No, don't worry, I'll get it. No, 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 no. You stay with your guests. Let her go and do it. So, how is business? Oh, it's doing great. Just the stress of it. Oh. I'm working on a major with Viral Edge wine. Oh, that's cool. Viral Edge, that's one of the leading wine companies in Africa. You can say that again. Oh, congratulations in advance. <laughs> not yet, sir. I mean, not until the deal is signed and sealed. <laughs> well spoken like a businessman. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, this is so smooth. Good. That is my wine, my product. Yeah, one of the best in Africa. Mm, I like your taste in wine. Products. Yeah. Thank you very much. Uh, well, I think I'll leave both of you to do some catching up, sir. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Mm. I'll see you Excuse later, Dad. Yeah, baby. Excuse me. Mm, your dad is so cool. Mm -hmm. I miss coming to this house. Would you like to try it? It tastes really good. No, not a fan of wine. Not a fan of wine. <laughs> <laughs> I say I hate you. I hate you so much. I hate you! <laughs> Eva, what is it? Do you want to enjoy yourself? Huh? Mom, can't you see? This is not that massive girl. She's trying to destroy my life. She's trying to take everything away from me. Can't you see? Calm down. If I control yourself, I am your mother. Do you think I'll watch that girl take everything away from you? Never. 
Come down, control yourself. I hate her. I hate her so much. Mom, I despise her. I know. I can understand. Don't be too quick to react. Don't be too quick to react. See, if you can't stand seeing them together, you go to your room. Do you hear me? I'm not going to my room. I'm not a coward. I'm not running away from her. I'm not. <sighs> Eva. Eva. Mm-hmm. Why wouldn't I be? I'm going on a date with a man I love. Mm -hmm. Hmm. So which one is it? Mm -hmm. I must say this first one. Look tall, tall, look tall, look tall. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. Look tall. And this? Mm, it looks sparkly. Gives you a present star kind of look. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very funny. And it's one of my best dress though. Uh, yeah. But I prefer I prefer this one. This one. Mm. Sexiness and all that. Mm. The taste is not so bad though. Yeah. I think I'll do this one then. Yeah. Mm. I'll go with this one then. Okay. okay. <laughs> thank you. Right, thank you so much. Hmm. Uh, Let me get dressed, huh? Okay. Okay. Uh, hold on, Peter. I've been meaning to ask you. Are you comfortable with this job? Like driving us around and getting paid peanuts? <laughs> peanuts, you say? I'm not <laughs> being paid peanuts. I'm more <laughs> Chief is trying. I'm the highest paid driver around here. Yes. Stop joking. Mm. You know, that was what I was offered, and I have to accept it. I don't have to turn it down. But you can get a job elsewhere and quit. I mean, a job that pays better. <sighs> job that pays better, you see. You must. You don't. You don't really get it. I can't do that. Leaving you in this house, you know, and people don't really care much about you. I can't risk that. <laughs> so you would rather deprive yourself of something good because of me? Masi, is it not worth it? <laughs> Peter. There you are! You're messing with the wrong person, Caleb. What did you do that for? So you want to play a fast one on me, right? I thought you said you were done with her! I told you that? When? Look, I can't remember ever telling you I was going to live up for you! Ke Ke Caleb! Hey, God. Wait, did you use me? You used me, right? Look, we both had our time. Oh, really? Huh. You're messing with the wrong person. Did you hear what I said? You are messing with the wrong person. I will so deal with you. Caleb, I swear, I will deal with you. You better stop playing. Do you understand? Stop playing. Because Caleb, I will so deal with you. I swear, I will deal with you. Is there a problem? No, not at all. There's no problem. We were just talking. She looks so beautiful. Thank you. Dressed up for you. <laughs> okay. Shall we? Yeah, sure. Okay. After you, my princess. God, I missed going out. Thank you. I mean, London was so boring. Oh. Yeah, I didn't really make lots of friends like that. And even the ones I made, I didn't have time to go out with them. I can imagine. So what is it for you now? What's next? Hmm. I mean, Daddy wants me to join the company, but left to me, I'd rather just start my own business or do something, to be honest. And marriage? What about marriage? <laughs> I mean, are you proposing to me? 
<clears throat> you see, past few years with you has been the best years of my life. And I would want nothing more than to spend the rest of my life with you. If you would accept me. How? Is this a proposal? Stop. Oh my god. Would you marry me? <laughs> yes, yes, Carl, I will marry you. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. I've waited so long to put this ring on your finger. Oh, it's so beautiful, Carl. Thank you. I love you. I love you too. Come here. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to tell daddy. <laughs> you like? I love it. Congratulations! Oh, I'm happy for you! Thank you so much, Dad. I'm so excited. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you just got proposed to. Eh? Anything more? Is that why you're acting like a child that just got a new toy? <laughs> Are you the first lady that receives an engagement ring from a man? Are you? Yes. Just be happy for her. For what exactly? Ordinary engagement ring. Oh, please grow up. Ha. Dad, I'm going to be in my room. Okay. Well, congratulations. Thank you, Daddy. Good night. <laughs> Grace, mm? if you can't be happy for her, just don't say anything. Mm? I don't understand. Stop you. acting as if you're scolding her. I don't understand, Chifu. When has uh, receiving an engagement ring become an achievement? I don't understand though. Eh? Eh, now when she starts building the company, eh, as my Eva has done over the years, eh, eh then I will congratulate her. <coughs> eh? But for this, <laughs> rubbish. Oh, let me change it, Jeremy. Are you sure of what you're telling me? <laughs> See, that rich, fine uncle engaged out. <laughs> but Peter, wait first. Let me ask you. Were you thinking that Massey, a high class, educated, sophisticated lady like that, was going to end up with you? <laughs> you are a dreamer. <laughs> Neka, come now. Come and tell me the whole thing now. Neka. Masi, you surprised me. You got engaged. Mm-hmm. Bling, bling. Isn't it beautiful? It's beautiful. <laughs> I just wish my mom was here. She would have blessed me. The chief is here for you. Chief is a very good man, and he loves you so much. I know, I mean, I'm excited, but it's just not complete without her. <sighs> so, you're getting married to me? Mm-hmm. And soon, I want to see your girlfriend too. I know you've been keeping her from me. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> I don't even have one. Is that so? I don't believe you. A dashing young man like you don't have a girlfriend. Come <laughs> on. <laughs> For now, money first. Ladies, they will come while there is money. Mm, you're right, you're right, you're right. I like that, I like that. But don't take too long. You know you're not getting any younger. <laughs> <laughs> I will. Oh, 
Come in. I came to congratulate you on your engagement. That's thoughtful of you. But please, can you leave now? <laughs> you know, Caleb, you hurt me. You know that, right? <sighs> Eva, you and I knew that what we had was heading nowhere. I'm with your sister. You knew that when you came on to me. Oh, really? I want to understand something. <sighs> What does Zumasi have that I don't have? What do you see in her that I do not have? Why do you choose her over me? Why? Are you seriously asking me that? You want to know? Yes. Okay, I love her because she's everything you're not. She's beautiful. She's respectful. She would never raise her hands to me. She's not ras and arrogant. So you're just thinking about all those things? It's just now you're realizing all this. You used me, right? <sighs> Caleb, you used me. Don't even go there. Because you make me really angry with you. I'm trying not to be rude here. You were the one who came on to me. And it takes two to tangle, in it? Hmm. Oh, really? What if I tell her we've been having an affair? What do you think will happen if I tell her what has been going on with us? You think she will believe you? Just have it at the back of your mind that I will make sure this marriage never works. I will make sure that this marriage never works. I'd like to see you try. Okay, we shall see then. Where did you start wearing designers? Or did you steal them from my daughter's wardrobe? No, ma, no. Madam Massey gave it to me. Liar! Liar! Massey would never buy a dress worth thousands of naira for you. For the last time, where did you steal the dress from? Huh? Madam, I swear to God, Madam Massey gave it to me, ma. <clears throat> Mom. Why are you embarrassing her? She's telling the truth, obviously. I bought it for her. So she's saying the truth? Yes. Oh, oh. wait. You mean, Mercy? You used her hard earned money to buy designers. Designers' dress for this common man who doesn't even know the worth of this dress. Mom, I have never, ever bought anything with dad's money. In fact, I worked and saved every single penny so that I could buy stuff when I was coming back. Okay. You never spend that money. You worked and earned everything. You used to buy what I was So you think buying this, um, you know, this costly dress for this girl uh, is the wisest thing to do? Yes, mom. And this is one out of many. Neka is not, is not just a maid. She's like a sister to me. Oh, oh, oh. Do you know know about this? Yes. And he's comfortable with whatever decision I decide to take. I mean, it's my money. Neka, come with me. Get out! Get out! Mom, can see, you... see, look at her! Big fat fool! You want to finish my, my food in this house? You idiot! Why are you not saying anything? Hmm? Why are you not saying anything? What do you want me to say? Oh! You have nothing to say, right? Nothing! Mm -mm. Because it is a mercy, you have nothing to say. Mm -hmm. If it were Eva now, you would want to bring down the whole house. That she's extravagant with her spending. <laughs> because it is mercy, you have nothing to say. That money belongs to mercy. She worked for it. So uh -huh. do you want me to tell her how to spend her money? What do you want me to tell her how to spend her money? So, 
That's all you have to say, right? Yes. That's all. Mm -hmm. No caution. No scolding. You're not going to do anything. Eh? Chief. How do you expect me to scold a fully grown woman? Blossoming. What if a husband? You want me to scold her? If you have nothing else to say, please leave. Eh? Chief! Leave. Before you came here, you saw me doing something. So I should go? Mm hmm. Chief! Chief! <laughs> no sense. Give me my chest and the girl with the Come on, mate. Ordinary mate. Eh? If I wear designers, you wear designers. No more respects. Eh? No more respects. What is wrong with you, foolish girl? See, you don't know the kind of clothes you wear. The ones they pick at uh, my two underbreeds. These are the kind of clothes you should wear. Eh? If I, if I hear pimp, if I hear pimp, I will move this one you're wearing and join it and burn all of them. Nonsense. Okay. Touch it. Oh. Touch it. <laughs> if I... Neka. Good afternoon, man. How are you? Fine, what man. are you making today? Vegetable soup. Mmm. My favorite. And I already tell by the smell. Uh, you enjoy this one or because I'm making it just the way you like it. It's okpo <laughs> <laughs> Do you need any help? No, 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 ma. Thank you. Naka, what are you wearing? What happened to the clothes I gave to you? Madame Bont then. What? Man, please don't 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 go and meet her because you should find that I told you she'll be she'll be so mad at me. Just look at what you're wearing. I mean, just because you are a maid doesn't mean that you are a slave. Look at what you are wearing. <sighs> don't worry, Neka. When I get to my own place, I'm taking you with me. These people clearly don't know your worth. <sighs> Anyways, what am I trying? You can't say you're acting when you're not contributing. It's not possible. Yeah. yeah, you do the talking for me. Lonely as it sounds. Your daughter is at it again. Sex in the mouth for one night's back. Put your hands up. <laughs> Young lady, where are you coming from at this time of day? Oh, Dad, good morning. Sorry, good evening. Good afternoon. I went grumpy. <laughs> I went to dance. Of course, I had to sweat. You know what I'm saying? You gotta act bad sometimes. <laughs> I saw. Get your hands off me. Come yeah, down. Take it easy now. <laughs> Be easy on her. She just got a little too no, drunk. A little. She didn't kill someone. Don't mind. Don't mind you, mom. Don't mind you, mom. That's why I love you. You won't leave me at the top. You see what you have raised. Lonely. You have spoiled this girl's sin. Now see what she has become. Uh, Are you satisfied? Uh, Are you? But I need to go to the club. Okay. Is this all? Uh, is go this to what you want me to entrust my company to? Calm down. Talk too much. Calm down. Chillax, okay? I need to take you to the club. Yeah, 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 yeah. You need to go to the club, daddy. You need to shake some ass. Act back. <laughs> What's going on here? Oh! Here comes that perfect daughter, the most perfectionist. <laughs> Always putting her mouth in the business of doing what I'm saying. You, you, I'll use you to do. Sonorous, come, 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 so let us eat. You guys, shut your eyes! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get 
see what your sister has become. A drunk. A drunk. <sighs> this is so funny. Does this happen regularly? Regularly. It's not an occasional thing. I thought we had talked about this, your attitude, and you had stopped. Every time. Ah! I was angry, so I started to go and clear my hair. Tifa, the way you're behaving, eh? How will your father hand over the company to you? Eh? How? I, I would have expected you to lie low until everything is settled. You are doing fine. Now you have, now you have messed up everything. Is that me? Uh, is that witch? That, that messy girl, that witch. She's the one that messed it up. Why did she come back? She should have just stayed back in London instead of coming back. Now she has messed up everything. It's not me. She don't want to be playing. All right. Please, Oya. I want you to get some sleep, eh? Tomorrow morning, you have to go and apologize to your father. Please. Never. Never. That man is always on my side. Never. <laughs> Never, ever. He's always on my side because of the way you were behaving. He doesn't like it. Mm. Don't worry. I want you to sleep. Mm. Okay? Mm. Tomorrow morning, you will see. <laughs> when you wake up tomorrow, you see the need to go and apologize to your father. Oh? Eh? Mm. You must sleep well, my dear. Oh? I'm so dizzy. When will this stop? Eh? When? Bad luck in the morning. Good morning, sis. Ah, what are you doing here? Go away, please. Go away. I came to have a conversation with you. Until I've had that conversation, I'm not going anywhere. Ah, shit. Eva, you came back really messed up yesterday. I don't understand. Are you here to lecture me? I mean, what right do I even have to lecture you? Thank God you know. Masi, say whatever you want to say and get out. Eva, it's about Dad. I mean, you really hurt him last night. He kept complaining of how sad he was to see you in that state. And how is it my fault? Sis, I'm not saying any of this is your fault. What I'm trying to say is, Dad is an old man. And he, can, he, he cannot be getting this amount of stress at his age. I mean, sis, you can do better. If not for anybody, but for Dad. I mean, this, the amount of stress on him is, 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 is not good. Masi, are you done? Okay, Eve. Maybe you should try and have a conversation with him during breakfast. It's the audacity for me. Really, it is. Wait, why did you even come back to Nigeria? Why? Excuse me. Yes, excuse you. I thought you were gone for good. I was working perfectly fine in dad's company. When, just when I was about inheriting everything, you brought your bad luck self here. Why? To ruin everything, right? Eva, I did not take anything from you. I mean, believe me, I don't even want any of this. <sighs> then go back. Go back and never show yourself here again, Masi. Go back, let me get my life back. Go! 
Eva, but you realize that I'm not your problem, right? I'm really not your problem in life. Get out. Get out of my room. Anyways, I've said what I came to say. Please, try and think about it, okay? Get out! Get out! That guy. That guy is, is really bad man. <laughs> so, I'm thinking of a really small wedding. Like, a beach wedding with just a few guests of attendance. The only problem is daddy thinks I deserve a bigger wedding. No, 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 no. Master. Master, listen. I second you for that. You don't know who you are. You are the daughter of a rich man. Huh? Chief is a very rich man, and a small wedding is an insult to his person. I must say this. Not you two thinking like that. Besides, you of all people should know how much I detest being in a crowd. Ugh. No, at this point, I, I must say, but your man, what is he saying at this point? He's fine with whatever I want. If we have accepted on, on what you said, then it's settled. Once, once he, he agrees to what you want, then the lesson is to explain to Chief. I was, I, I trust Chief. He will, he will surely understand. I want <sighs> you understand. We go ahead with it. Oh, Peter, it's always such a relief to talk to you. I always count on you. <laughs> you have no idea. Anyway, who made this life? I did. Hmm. You, mommy. Yes, now. After being abroad for so many years, you think I look like you? Yeah. I mean, Neka was tired from doing all the house chores, so I told her to go and rest. So, I did this. Now look oh, at how you're enjoying oh, it. <laughs> Peter, what are you doing sitting on my dining table? Good morning, ma. Uh, good afternoon. What is good about the morning and afternoon? Young man, answer me. What are you doing eating on my dining table? I invited him. Oh, you did? I am not surprised. It is clear that you are the one encouraging them to overstep their boundaries in this house. Eh, Masi? You are gradually turning this house into a party ground for a wretched, poor, dirty fools like you and your mother. Huh? Don't you ever talk about my mom like that. See, cockroach? Huh? If I talk about that, I'm like, what will you do? What will you do? Peter, Ma? before I blink my eyes and open it, disappear! Disappear! Look at you, poor man, forming rich man. You're eating and dining table. Oh, this house needs me. Can you show me this? Neka! Neka! Bring me my fresh now! Nonsense! Dad, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for coming home late and, and drinking. I promise it won't happen again. It won't repeat itself again. Ever. You have apologized and apologized over the same offense over and over and over without you making any attempt to change. That makes the whole apology useless. That I'm sorry. Okay, this... This will be the last time. <laughs> I've heard that over and over. Over and over. Dad, this will be the last time. It makes your, this will be the last time useless. It never comes to pass. Let me tell you, I've lost faith in you. And I'm sorry now. Hmm? I'm really sorry. I promise you, it won't happen again. That also, I've had a million times. <laughs> it will happen again. Can't you ever change to be like your sister, Massey? Just a little adjustment. A little adjustment. Dad, is there always a need for you to compare me and I'm Eva, she's in Massey. We are two different people. Why are you always comparing us? That's true. Like day and night. Two of you are two different people. Eh? But I'm asking you, can't you just adjust? Try a little bit to be like her, then you become a good person. 
You know what? Forget about me apologizing. Excuse me. Every time. Massy, 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 massy. Every time. <laughs> well, I still think we should stick to what your father wants. I get his point. There will be dignitaries in attendance mm. and it would be disappointing not to meet something up to standard. What do you want? You know I always want what you want. But then again, I'm trying to understand why he doesn't see it from that point of view. Besides, you are a princess and you deserve a royal wedding. <laughs> <laughs> I can say that again. You are a princess, my princess, <laughs> and you deserve a royal wedding. <laughs> That's so sweet. <laughs> but I'm still going for a small wedding. Gosh, you're so impossible. <laughs> I know. And it's not up for debate. I mean, I'm, I'm the one getting married, not my dad. So, it's decided it's a small wedding. Yes, your majesty. Cool. <laughs> Call! Call! Yes, baby. Is everything okay? Why is your face like that? So you're cheating on me? No. I will even think a thing like that. Then explain this. What is this doing on your bed? I don't know. Oh, it must be my sister's. Yes, Nilo was here one time I went for a business meeting. And she slept in your room? I mean... Uh you know these things with content creators. Probably she needed a different background for her videos. C come on. I can't believe you ever think I would cheat on you. I'm sorry, it's just that I saw sorry on your bed and I just flipped. It's okay. No offense taken. Look, I want you to know that I would never ever look at another lady. Not to talk of cheating. I only have my eyes on you. <laughs> Lana, baby. I'm sorry, okay? It's okay. You know I love you. <laughs> okay. I get this out of here. <laughs> Please do my kids. Hey, you too. I did cheat. You know. No, hey. I did In fact, let me finish playing this scene. Uh, hold on, uh, hold on. Hey, this is <laughs> Go to ah. market. Hey, 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 hey. Mm, I don't have this one. Hey! <laughs> Check! Hey! You are very wicked. You are very wicked. <laughs> you see these two? There's something going on between them. You think something is going on between the two? I don't think. I know it. Just look at them. Can't you see? Look at them. These kids don't have to think good shit. No single shit. At all. Daddy's favorites. Don't tell me. Let's go, Jerry. Madam Eva, how was it? Be more careful. What is wrong with you? I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry, ma. I'm so sorry. Ma. Where are you going to? To get another one for you. I don't need it. Clean this up. Uh, Come back here. I said you should clean it up. Ma, I want to get a mop stick. Sorry. I want to go and get mop stick. Take off your shirt. My shirt? Why? Don't ask me questions. Are you, are you normal? Take off your shirt!
I said take it off. Now use it to clean the floor. Clean the floor, you okay? Why are you looking at me? Clean it up! Don't look at me, clean it up right now! Yeah, that's more like it. Peter, what are you doing? You asked him to clean the floor with his clothes? I don't understand, what's so special about his clothes? I believe rags are even more valuable than it. Clean it up, you're looking at me! Peter, get up. <laughs> no, he spilled it, so he has to clean it, or else you want to help him. That is clearly not his job, ever. Where's, where's the necker? Who cares if it's not his job? I don't know. You know, I came to the market to get something. I was thirsty, so I needed someone to get me water. And you couldn't go and get your drink? What happened to your hands? Peter, get up. I'll clean it. Get up. Give it to me. I'll clean it. Ow. So love bad. <laughs> I knew there was something going on between you two. This just confirmed my suspicion. Hmm? You can't watch him being humiliated, right? Your head is clearly filled with nonsense. I pity you honestly. Because ever your character sucks. Oh, really? Yes. You know what? <laughs> you know for a fact that you actually belong here, like those classless people. You are not fit to be a Hamilton because you come from dirt, obviously. Get that from my face. Boy. And bring another water. I'm testing. Hey, baby. What are you doing here? I thought we were over this. Is that so? Swear that you don't miss me. You don't miss me, my torch. You don't miss all that. Look, I don't miss you at all. I'm in fact relieved that we're not together. Ouch. That's a hurtful thing to say to a girl. But I don't mind because it's you. <laughs> I will let it go. Because it's you. <clears throat> Look, Eva, you can't stay here. You need to leave my house right now. I don't want my woman coming in here to meet you. Woman. Your woman. Do you trust her? Do you trust this your woman? What are you talking about? Well, your woman has been cheating with you, with our driver. <laughs> what? If you want to tell a lie, tell a better lie. You want me to believe that my mercy is cheating with a driver? Well, I have evidence because I know you will not trust me. You won't believe me. This is it. This is your woman cheating on you. Uh -huh. Take it. What is this? What is this now? Just two people laughing? This means nothing. This proves absolutely nothing. Eva, if, if you want to tell a lie, tell a better lie. Now, please, get out of my house. Caleb, one day, you will get to find out that you've been played. And I was right all along. You sound really crazy. I see something is wrong with your head. You need a psychologist. Now, get the hell out of my house. I'll be back. Crazy woman. Dad? Yeah, baby. Can I have a minute? Sure. Okay. Um, so, I was going through the company's record here yeah, on the accounts, and I noticed that for the past three years, there's been some discrepancies. So take a look at this. See? There's just some money that are not connected. 
Something is just not right. It's not adding up, Dad. Huh. Look at this as well. Somebody is messing with the accounts. Take a look at this record as well. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't add up at all. Hmm, this is not bad. Add to cut. Hmm. I like this one too. It's gonna shoot my neck. Add to cut. Uh, no, 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 this is not the new one. This is the old version now. The client. Hi. The client. This is my info now. Ha, yeah, hello Daniel, what's up? Why is my card declining? I'm trying to pay for stuff online and it keeps declining. Why? Sorry? What? My, my dad did what? And how come you never told me? I'll call you back, I'll call you back. He, dec he declined my card. For what? Dad, yeah. why are my accounts blocked? Good thing you are here. Uh, I need an explanation on what has been happening to the company's account in the past three years. In fact, since you started running it. Dad, I just embarrassed myself out there, unable to pay for clothes that I picked. That does not answer my question. There is a 50 million naira that is missing from the account without authorization. So can you explain? How am I supposed to know? How are you supposed to know? Yeah, how am I supposed to know? Oh. Mm. How are you supposed to know? All right. From now onwards, I don't want to see you anywhere around that office. Dad? Until there's an explanation. And that's not all. All your accounts remain frozen. But that this is not fair. How am I supposed to function without money? How am I supposed to know? It's not my business. This is your doing, right? You actually did this, right? But dad, I told you to let it go. Not this time around. She has to give an account. What is wrong with you? Please stop calling me. I've told you to stop calling my lion. Eh? What is wrong with you? Please, I don't have your time. I don't have your time. Get off my phone. Idiot. Mom, mom, please go and talk to your husband. Your husband has blocked my account. If I get off my way, I have my own issues to take care of. You take care of yours! Mom! What's wrong with her? What's wrong with her? Mom! Mom!
Ah. Am I, am I, am I pregnant? No, 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 it's not possible. I'm not pregnant. Nah. Darling, I, I I need some money, like um, ten million naira. Well, that won't be a problem. You have more than that in your account, so why do you need it? Oh, I do, but that's some fixed deposit. I can't assess it now. You know, this ten million is to add up to what I have, what I want to do. I want to purchase something for my brother through a friend. <laughs> Sorry to inform you that I no longer run the account. Eh? But my personal account and the business account, they are all being managed by Mercy now. Hmm? So if you need anything, meet Mercy. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I, I know. You're joking. You're joking, right? Huh? Do I look like a comedian to you? <laughs> so, you mean I should go to the girl you got outside wedlock and beg her for money? This is a joke. It's a joke. You see, that girl that I got out of wedlock has proven to be more responsible than you and your daughter put together. <clears throat> so, like I said, if you need anything, go and meet her. Chief, this is an insult on me! An insult on me! White lock, as if. <laughs> Eva, your father has done it. He has oh, done it! Mother, please, not now. Please. Oh, <laughs> not now. It may interest you that your father has given the control of all his money to that, that his illegitimate daughter of his. Sorry, sorry. Come again. That, that did what? <laughs> I have not come before, but I have landed now. Let me shock you. I asked him for money. You know what he told me? He said I should go to her. Whatever I need, I should go to her. See, your father has disrespected and disregarded me in this house. But this is the last straw. I will no more dance to his region. Not anymore. Not anymore. Mercy. Mercy, that stupid girl. Hello, Mercy, or whatever you call your name, take this account number. Send 10 million into this account now. What's this for? Are you stupid? Are you mad? You don't get to ask me questions. Do as I say. Well, I mean, can you explain what you need 10 million naira for? That's a lot of money. If you're not going to explain, I'm sorry, I won't be sending any money. <laughs> Mas, you don't want to try me. You don't want to bring out the venom in me. Because when you see it, you won't like it. Transfer the money right away. Unless you explain to me what you need 10 million naira for. A ridiculous amount of money. I'm sorry, like I said, I won't be sending any money. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I will leave the account number with you. You have to 3 p.m. 3 p.m. <sighs> 
to transfer the money. Else! Since you will not give me peace, I will get peace somewhere else. I told you, unless you tell me how much you need that money for. I'm not you, giving you anything. Mercy! You're working out on me! You are working. Ah! On me, you are walking out on me. <sighs> she just walked out on me. She walked out on me. <sighs> All right, no problem. No problem. I hear you're here. Master just insulted me. Yes, she just insulted me, but I don't blame her. You gave her the leverage to disrespect me in this house. Yes, by putting her in charge of everything. When you brought her into this house and you told me that she's the child you had outside wedlock, I accepted her. I allowed you to love her as your own. She got the best education. Did her masters abroad? No arguments. I didn't argue about that. But this one you did. Leaving your own daughter, your own daughter and myself under her mercy is not acceptable. And I won't take that. Point of correction. I did not leave everything to her. <laughs> I made a decision to put her in charge because of the way that... Your daughter has been extravagantly spending money in this house. In fact, the both of you. And, my mom. and until I see a change in your attitude, mercy remains in charge. Mm. Yes. Mm. <sighs> ah, all right. <laughs> You've made your decision. Right? Yes, I've made my decision. Okay. <laughs> You've made your decision. It is time for me to make mine. You will hear from me. And don't complain when you hear. I hear. Ah, you really added though. I have. Yeah, you look very big. I'm sure it must be for more the pizza I was eating. No, 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 no. I think it's just the environment. No. I really, really missed the uh, Neckers cooking. Yeah. This killer. Hi, babe. Ah, that's him. Hi, babe. Hi. You should have told me you were coming. I left you a message. Didn't you get it? Oh, I'm so sorry. My phone must, must be inside. I haven't been with it. Um, okay, come in. Okay, let me get something. I'm coming. Okay, see you, see okay. you later. Peter. Okay. What was that you were doing with the driver outside? Oh, Peter. He's not just a driver, he's my friend. That's how other bosses treat their drivers? You guys are too close for my liking. <laughs> I mean, we've been that close for as long as I can remember. We went to the same high school and he's been a great friend. Are you cheating on me with him? <laughs> Wait, what? Cheating on you with who? Peter. Come on, man. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, why would you even say something like that? Look, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not comfortable with your closeness. You have to keep your distance, please. Are you jealous? No. Yes, you are. <laughs> I mean, you don't have anything to worry about. You know I would never cheat on you. Hmm? All right. Go freshen up and dress up for me. So, where are you taking me? It's a surprise. Just look hard for me. <laughs> okay. Right, I'm waiting downstairs. All right, I'll see you shortly. Okay. Oh. 
Oh, look who we have here. <laughs> it's a good thing you're actually here. I've been trying to call you, but you choose to ignore my call. I drop at your place, you're nowhere around as usual. I'm not interested in having any conversation with you. Leave me the hell alone, please. We need to talk. There's nothing to talk about. Unfortunately for you, there is. I'm carrying your seed. There's a seed growing inside of me. I'm pregnant. <laughs> Drama queen. Drama, right? Another drop of luck. If this is a plot to destroy what I have with your sister, then you fail. I'm not lying, Carl. Do you think I'm lying here? I did a test and it's positive. I'm pregnant! Pregnant? For who? Hey, they play. For you! I'm pregnant for you, Caleb. Carry your child. Can you just stop saying that? Mm. Did you just <laughs> say you're pregnant for Caleb? No, no babe. She's, she's, she's lying. She's delusional. I don't know what she's talking about. Eva, I'm going to ask you one more time. Are you pregnant for Caleb? Yes. You heard me right. We started seeing each other a few months after you traveled. Babes, don't believe her. She's obviously trying to tear us apart. As a matter of fact, she was the one who told me you were cheating on me with your driver. What? I heard now. No, this one is true. No, no, it's true, it's true, it's true. I actually thought both of you were seeing each other. Yeah, both of you look like a perfect couple. I don't care. I'm pregnant and I'm not sorry about it. Pregnant. I can't do this. Babes, don't listen to what? Babes, babes, come on, let's go and do scan. For example, boy or girl. Babes, babes, you best believe me. Caleb, please just go. I don't want to hear any explanation from you. Just go! Babe, please listen to me. You best believe me. It's not exactly what you think. That snitch of a girl you call your sister is trying to separate us. Do you think I'm stupid? Now hold on a second, please. The bra I saw in your house the last time that you lied was your sister's own, it was Eve's own, right? Answer me! Babes, babes, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm truly sorry. What are you sorry for exactly? For, 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 for everything. It wasn't my fault. It was the devil. It was Eva. I, she was the one who came on to me. I did everything to resist. So you're admitting to me that you've been cheating on me with her? Please just go, okay? But not without this. No, 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 babes, don't do this, please. Get out while I'm still being nice to you. So you know I love you. I I'm truly sorry. Please forgive me. Get out! Get out! <sighs> oh my god. This can't be happening. Oh my god. Aren't you ashamed? Aren't you ashamed of yourself telling me that you are pregnant? Pregnant for the same man that your sister is engaged to. I'm ashamed of you. Chief, ah, what is that? This I'm ashamed of you. I'm ashamed of you. It's too much now. Eh? Huh? What has happened has happened. You don't need to blame her. Yes, now. I, I, after all, it takes two to tango. Eh? Uh, the young man should equally be blamed. Huh? at you, encouraging and enabling her bad behaviors, instead of you pointing her to good morals like every other mother does. This here is a result of the demon that you created. Yeah, no chief, no, no, I, I, I can't take that one, no. I can't take you calling my, my daughter demon now for what now? Why? Uh, is she not your daughter? Yes, she's not equally your daughter. What have you done as a father? What have you done to train her? Huh? Whether you're blaming, blaming, ah, you go. Also blame yourself.
Good day, Chief. What? After what we have done, you have the guts to show up here? Sir, I'm truly sorry for what I did to your daughter. I love her and I don't want to lose her. Shut up! Ah. You hurt my little girl and you're here to say you're sorry! Sorry for yourself! So I know I erred. I know I made a very huge mistake. But I'm here to make amends. It was not in my intention. Damn it! Make amends! You got her sister pregnant! Dummy! And you say you're here to make... Listen. Before I look around, you get out of my house. I don't want to see your leg anywhere near my house again. If I get you, I will cripple you on both legs. Sir, I love your daughter. Get out! Sir, I don't want to lose her. It was not in my intention to, to hurt her. Stupid boy. I wanted to have a fairy tale wedding. A happily ever after. I wanted a complete family for my children. The one I didn't have growing up. I loved the way he loved me. I thought I had found my missing piece. I thought I had found the man that would make all my dreams come true. Peter, I was wrong. Kelly broke me. He broke me. But it's okay. It's okay. Caleb doesn't know what he just makes. He doesn't deserve this. This is your precious tears. He doesn't. He broke me. It's okay. It's okay. You know what? Stop crying. He doesn't deserve you. You deserve better. The right guy will come. Hmm? Madam, where is the money? I don't have it right now. Give me time to arrange it for you. Madam, you know I'm not a patient type. If we don't bring it, I will talk. Dr. Paul, for over 10 years, you've been ripping me off every penny I have. Just to keep my secret. I am tired. I am tired. I know you never stop blackmailing me. That's why I've decided not to give you anything. Well, madam, I'm giving you two more days. If you don't bring it, don't blame me for whatever comes up next. Is that all? Yes, madam. Come in. Uh, ma, someone delivered this to you, ma. From whom? I don't know, ma. There's a note here. Let me see. Take, take. Trash it. Ma? Take it to the bin. Yes, ma'am. I don't accept any other thing like this from this particular person. Yes, ma'am. I want to take you out. <laughs> you want to take me out? Yes. <laughs> hmm. Masi, seriously, I'm not happy. 
seeing you just yesterday, you you are you are inside throughout the day. I'm worried about you. You want to take me out, Peter? Yes. Okay, I'll get dressed. Peter, I promise you, I will take you to a lively place that you're going to love. Pro I promise you, you will love the things you will see there. They will make your day and make you more happier. Okay, let's do it. Yeah, please get dressed. Okay. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you. All right. This is not bad. It's really nice. I told you. <laughs> it's a very nice place. Uh, but see, just when last did you take beer? Did you say beer? Beer. <laughs> I don't drink alcohol. Are you serious? You don't like it, or you have not tested it before? I've never tried it before, but I also don't do alcohol, so yes. No. <laughs> okay. I've not had it before. Okay. Let's see, just one bottle. Peter, I said no. I don't know what one chill bottle of beer can do for you. <laughs> you, don't, you don't know. Peter, See, please tell her to give me water, please. No, no way, no way. Mama, just two bottles of beer. All right, sir. <laughs> you will not give up. You are so persistent. Masi, listen. I won't allow you to take more than one bottle. Mm. Yes. And if you, even if you get drunk, I will take care of you. I'm not serious. <laughs> Baba, be fast. Ah, that was fun. Fun indeed. Thank you. <laughs> this is a tipsy. Just a little bit. I mean, but it feels amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you say. <laughs> you are really amazing. In fact, you surprised me. Mm. You are so compassionate. <laughs> Seriously, I, you don't even judge me regardless of the kind of job I do. Mm. Eh? I really appreciate you. Mm. <laughs> you can say that again. I mean, I appreciate your friendship too. I appreciate the fact that you are always there for me. And thank you very much for taking me out tonight. That beer was very much what I needed. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, before I forget, I'm throwing a small party on Sunday for my birthday. <laughs> You are invited. I'm honored. I'm honored. Okay. Have a good night. Let me go and pass out. <laughs> good night. <laughs> good morning, Dad. Oh, someone is on the bright side today. <laughs> yes, Dad. I won't be crying over something that wasn't meant to be. I mean, if he was, he wouldn't have done what he did in the first place. So, I'm not crying anymore. That's the right <laughs> spirit. Hmm? I love that. Now, let us discuss about your forthcoming birthday. Mm -hmm. What will you have for your 25th birthday? Hmm. Are you asking? Yep. Are you not scared that I'll be greedy, Daddy? And oh, steal your no, money. No, 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 no. <laughs> you know you are always loved. Hmm? And mm. whatever you ask, you will get because you deserve it. Hmm? Hmm. So, what do you want? Let me think. Let's see. What do I want? What do I need? You know what? I think I have everything here, Daddy. Ah. Yes, and I don't need anything. Thank you so much, Daddy, for all you do. I love you. Oh, I love you too, my But <laughs> you still need to make a wish. True. Oh, let me get the door done. Okay. Hello. Who's coming? Dad, I think someone is here to see you. Oh, Dr. Paul. Mr. Chief. What a pleasant surprise. It's been a while since we saw each other. Uh, I think the last time we saw was uh, 
during my daughter's uh, surgery some 10 years ago, yes. In fact, if you are right, I have been in and out of the country. Oh. Mostly out of the country. Oh, that's nice. That's nice to hear. Um, <clears throat> meet my daughter, Mercy. Oh, Chief, I don't know you have another grown up daughter. Yes, I do. Nice to meet you, my dear. Same here, sir. So, what do I owe this uh, surprise visit? I hope uh, the economic and financial crime people are not after my life. <laughs> anyway, Masi, uh, yes, get him something to drink. Okay. No, 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 Chief. I'm okay. I'm fine. Don't bother yourself. Are you sure? Yes, I'm okay. Oh, okay. I'm very okay. All right. Yeah. What? Darling. Honey? Yes, sir. Honey, why do you look so shocked? Because she tries to kill me. What? What, what was he talking about? No, no, no. no. Tried to kill you. No, no, no. How? Please. You thought you succeeded. But we had to reveal the secret. You had for your family since. No, no, no. What? No, no, no. Don't listen to him, oh. Don't listen to him, oh. This man is talking nonsense. How come? How and when did I try to kill you now? How? How? Chief, you know me now. You know Grace. I am not capable of hurting anybody, hurting someone. Eh? You know what? Get up and leave my house now. Or I'll call the police for you and charge you for defamation of character. Wait, leave my house. What's going on here? Chief, I'm sorry to announce. Shut up and leave my house! Woman, what's wrong with you? Let him talk. He has nothing to talk. See, whatever he's going to say now is going to spew trash. Get up and leave my house now. Get up. Get up and leave my house. So leave my house. Chief, Eva is not a daughter. What? What is he talking about? What are you talking about? Please, doctor, I hope everything went well. You can now operate on my daughter. Madam. Sir. Where is your husband? He just stepped out to get some toiletries. I hope everything is fine. Is my daughter okay? Madam. Doctor. I'm sorry to tell you we couldn't find a match. <laughs> I don't understand. What about her father? <laughs> Madam. Is chief really the father of the baby? Because the blood could not match, madam. What do you mean the blood couldn't match? He is her father. No, 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 madam. Chief is not the father. Please God. Please God, help me. Finished. Doctor, please, please, I beg, let this be between us, please, for now, I beg you, at least until my daughter is fine, I beg you, please, doctor. Madam. Sir. We don't have her blood type in our bank right now. I advise you to please try and get Mr. Thompson. For us to save the life of the baby first. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll, I'll, I'll do just that. It's okay, madam. There's no problem. Give. Ivan is not a daughter. Wait. Yes. What? He's the daughter of your former security guard, Mr. Thompson. Wait. Mom? What, what is he talking what? about? Uh, Forgive me. I beg you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You slept with my security guard. You dishonored me. And for 26 years, oh. you have made me believe that his daughter is my daughter. How wicked could you be? Uh, no, 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 no. You see, I, I didn't know. I didn't know that she she wasn't your daughter. I didn't know. I didn't know. It was me. She went for surgery, and I got to know. I swear. I swear. I did not know. So I didn't know. Please so keep, keep you me. cheated on me. You lied and deceived me. 
You knew the truth all this while. And you decided to keep it away from me. No, 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 darling, listen to me. I, I, I don't want to lose you, please. I, I love you. I love you, please. Please forgive me. Find a place in your heart to forgive me. I please. want both of you to leave my house ah, this minute. No. Dad, please. please, I'm begging you. Please, I'm begging you. If by evening you are still here, you will see the part of me Dad. that you never dreamt of. Daddy, you can't send them away. They are family, Dad. They are going to stay. please. I beg. I beg, Jim. Jim, please. Please. Jim, please. 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 Jim, please. Forgive me. Forgive me. Jim, forgive me. Mom, oh, what did you do? Please. 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 I beg you. You're my daughter. I love you so much. I want to hear me talk to you. Please talk to you. Please listen to you. Please. I'm not begging not to throw us out. If you throw us out, where are we going to go? Please. Please. Mom, how could you? How could you? Don't call my name. Don't call me. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. If I smell, if I smell, it's me. I beg, I beg you. Mercy, help me. Beg you. I beg you. Please, I beg you. If you are here and try to convince me to forgive them, forget it because my mind is already made up. If the woman that I've been married to for 27 years could treat me in such a way, it's unforgivable. I was busy building my business, running around, trying to give her a better life. While she was busy running around, having fun with God knows who. So please, they must go. Dad, I'm not here to plead on their behalf. I just have one question for you. Dad, why would you harshly punish someone for a sin that you're equally guilty of? Yes, Dad. I am a product of that sin. Dad. I'm not saying that what she did was right. No. But you did the same thing. And yes, she hasn't liked me very much. Neither has she treated me fairly. But that I understand her. I mean, no woman, absolutely no woman, would be happy to wake up one morning and find that her husband has a child outside their marriage. And he wants to bring that child home because her mother died. That you lied and cheated on that woman too. <sighs> and Eva, whether you like it or not, Dad, she is your daughter. She has only known you to be her father. She has only loved and embraced you, Dad. She has only looked up to you. So tell me, why would you want to punish, punish her for something that she had no control whatsoever? Dad, I'm only here to advise you that before you make any decision, you need to think it through. My friend, things are really happening now. So this Eve girl, this rude, arrogant girl, is not even Chief's real daughter. And Madame, who is always spiting on us, insulting us, calling us name, 
had the cause to sleep with a common security guy. Get man for that matter. No, I don't believe this. Nega, you better stay your believe. This is not our business. Sam, 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 it's not our business. It's not our concern. Please, I don't want to engage myself in this conversation anymore with you. Please. I beg shifts. Why are you being so cranky? Me, I love the way the table has turned. Eh? This mother and daughter that are always insulting the mercy, calling her adopted child, is even the real child of chief. Can you imagine? Me, I'm happy, yo. Hmm. Hmm. Dad, please do not look at me any different. You are my father, right? You are, you are my father. Come here. Of course. Of course I'm your daddy. I'm your father. Stay my little girl. Yeah. Uh. I'm sorry. I'm deeply sorry for all the pain I've caused you. Please forgive me, please. I forgive you. In spite of everything, I still love you. You are still my little girl. Hmm? You are not to be blamed for anything. It's all your mother's doing. Hmm? You're still my baby girl. My baby girl. Hmm? Thank you. Thank you, Daddy. Yeah, baby. Thank you. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I'm leaving. Please, I pray that one day you will find a place in your heart to forgive me. My darling, thank you so much. Thank you for not punishing Eva for my sins. Mercy, please, take good care of your father. Make sure he takes his medication as that went to you. You know, he's forgetful. Please remind him to take his medications. It's your husband. You should look after him. This, this is not right, Dad, please. Please, Dad. Please. Thank you so much, and then I sincerely want to apologize to you for all I've done to you. Please, you are a sweet girl. Thank you. Wait. You don't have to go. This is your home. This house belongs to you as much as it belongs to anyone else. This is your home. Don't take this as forgiveness because I, I, I don't know whether I will ever forgive you for what you have done. Thank you so much, Thank you. Always working. Shut <laughs> down. Take. Thank you. You're welcome. 
Well, I guess we're on the same boat now. Two illegitimate daughters. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Master, can I talk to you? Sure. Masi, I never hated you. Believe me, I envied you. For real, I envied you so much. I, I wished to be like you. Because you're just so perfect, like, I can't even describe it. You were so perfect. Despite the fact that you're way younger. You're so smart, so composed. Like, you're intelligent. You have everything. I feel, I feel intimidated by you sometimes, to be very honest. I, I'm sorry, okay? And the only way I could make myself feel better was to pick on you. Yeah. Everybody loves you. You get what you want so easily. You carry yourself with so much charisma. Like, you have everything. You have the love. Dad loves you. Caleb loves you. Please, let's not talk about him. I mean, you have him now, so... God forbid. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 no. He's not mine. But jokes apart, Masi, I'm sorry. I'm deeply sorry for trying to take the life that you have. I'm so sorry. Come on, sis. There's no need to apologize. I mean, at least you saved me from marrying an unfaithful man, so... I guess that's fine. I lied. I'm not pregnant. What? Masi. I'm sorry, but I lied. I I lied to you. I lied to everyone. I was I'm not pregnant. I I only said that just to ruin your relationship with Caleb. I'm sorry. The truth is, Caleb loves you. He never wanted me. He really, really loves you, Masi. I'm sorry. And he cheated on me with you. Come on, what kind of love is that? I mean, if that's what love is, I don't want it. I don't. It was all my fault. I'm the one to be blamed. I, I, I cost others. Please, please forgive me, Masi, please. <sighs> This is a lot, sis. <sighs> Eva. Talking about forgiveness, sis. You need to forgive your mom. I mean, yeah, she lied to everybody. But we all know why she did it. She did all of this just to protect you, to keep you safe. Eva, she needs you. She needs you to comfort her now, more than ever, okay? And also, before I forget, there are two people in this house that also deserves your apology. Peter and Neka. Eva, you treated them like they were not even humans. <sighs> and most importantly, you need to forgive yourself, okay? You need to forgive yourself in order to be able to heal properly. <sighs> and as for me, I bear no grudges, sis. You're my sister, and I will always, always love you. Thank you. 
Okay. <laughs> Must be so happy. Same here. No. Yes, come in. Babes. Hi. You're here. How have you been? Oh, see, babes, I'm truly sorry for everything I did. For ever hurting you, for breaking your trust. If I could go back in time, I would do things differently. I will not disappoint you again. I'm truly sorry. Stop apologizing. Now where's my ring? With all pleasure. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 